a, a favor? Humor me and look at my face for a second. See anything? No. No? No. What should I be looking for? Familiarity? Um, I told you. I didn't even notice you at that bar. So. But I noticed you well before that. This isn't funny. It's not meant to be. Why are you- Because I need you. Uh, look, I think that you've got me confused for somebody else. Believe me, I don't. Um, look, I really just want to get this fight over with. I want to go home and I, I really don't want to have to call a flight attendant. Are you uncomfortable? Very. Then Lisa, with all due respect, you don't have the first clue what true discomfort really is. What do you want? For you to keep listening. I don't have to do that. J.R. John Rubin, your father. You gave that to him, what, last Christmas? Oh my god. The monogram's a great touch. Kind of a funny coincidence how he and I share the same initials. Open it, quickly. See, to you, this is definitely Dad's wallet. But to the flight attendant or anyone else you're thinking about complaining to, it's mine. But for some reason, oh, Miss Stewardess, Agent Smithers, this emotionally distraught woman sitting next to me, who I've never met in my life, suddenly had this crazed obsession for it when I took it out of my pocket. Or something like that. What have you done with it? Nothing. As long as you stay quiet. If not, you'll have another untimely tragedy on your hands. But you may want to wipe those tears if you're at least considering doing the right thing. Did you need something? Well, Lise, did you want another pillow?